Good freaking morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today is a interesting day, to say the least, for two reasons. A, we are pulling the power plant, I should say donor power plant, out of the wreck Denali to put into the S10. And two, today, marks the 20th anniversary of 9-11. Insane. And the crazy thing is anybody that watches this video that was, you know, older knows exactly what they were doing, where they were on that day. So, with that being said, Let's get over to the shop so we can load up all the stuff to pull this motor out. Yep, yeah, we're at the shop. Gonna load up the engine stand. I mean, not the engine stand. We definitely need the engine hoist. Jack. Oh, that's right, I forgot. Marky installed these fucking work lights. You can actually see in here now. Yep. So, yeah. We will see you guys up there. All right, guys, we're here. There it is. Well, wow, that's an interesting sticker to say the least. Yeah. Plugs on that's what 500 bucks to get you. All right. So the plan of attack is that thing don't have any brakes. So we're gonna drag it down the hill. So it doesn't slam in to a tree. Ugh. My bad. You know what? You know what? Whatever. You kind of hand it to me. Let's just throw it in the weeds. You like the weeds, dude. I mean, this, <laughs> oh, that's the this looks good on paper, but. Probably no bumper here anyway. We'll find out though. <laughs> mark, mark, mark. Holy bugs, man. Welcome to, Welcome to the country, guys. Get your son out of the way. You ain't, you, you something else, kid. Three tow truck drivers, what could possibly go wrong? Yeah. Chris, I'm thinking, even though it's in park, the front tire should roll if you want to steer. Let's just see if he can move. He's going to rip the bumper right off. Let's get and it's going to blow out his back window. Bumper's going to go out. Yep, that, that worked all right. Perfect. Come back further. Oh, you got plenty of chain. Yeah, bumper's a little rotted. Mark, a bumper's rotted. Only that corner. <laughs> <laughs> we swear we don't tow cars like this. We don't? I mean, well, maybe Mark does, because he does junk cars. Are you reusing any of the suspension back here? No. No. Literally taking the motor in the drive line. That's it. So if you're going to tie to the axle, send it. Dude, that just crumpled. Like, there was. <laughs> it I, I did. It did nope. It didn't even, like. You're not going to break that. You're around everything. All those. 
sway bars, brake lines, everything. The passenger seat. Watch, watch your kid. Watch out, buddy. Hang on, let's. That's okay. Keep going, Marky. You're good. That couldn't have worked any better. Beautiful. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Your dikes and your sharp knife out. All right, this has to come off. Soon which is it's off. just gonna flip right down, which is no big deal. Saving that hose? No. No, because it's different on the S10s. Back Cause no, the the inlet's gonna be here. It's gonna go Nobody, right in. You doesn't want to save any of this parts for your truck? No, it's a twenty five dollar hose. Yeah, well look at it. Look at it right here. <laughs> All right, guys. So let's go. We're gonna do a little time lapse. Then we'll come back when they're getting ready to pull it out. off exhaust is disconnected pull front clips out now we just got to pull apart the or actually should they pull apart but disconnect the uh, drive shaft pull the transmission mount a few more hoses and wires and she will be free get the gist of it so back to another time lapse and on top all you mechanics missing your 10 millimeter we found it mark just pulled it out of the motor That's the other guy. There's a NASA guy that does videos too. This guy's got bald and he's building that electric hammer. Yep. yep. So if you're wondering what Mark has in his hands, it is ICT billet and it covers the holes up for the exhaust. They got eye, eye rings, O rings on the inside. So instead of taping it up, you can be fancy and you can flex. And they make but, ones for the intake too, but I just didn't buy them in time. Yeah. Like but even then we can just keep the motor cover the the plate on it yeah. to cover up the intake so everything's pretty much disconnected up here guys we got to go underneath mm. a couple <laughs> little odds and ends well you know you always figure it out once you start pulling and things are connected yeah the beautiful thing is we don't need the harness for the truck because 
Mark wants to run it carbureted. <clears throat> Simplicity. You do? Yeah. It looks a hell of a lot better. Um, what you know with those um, throttle body, four barrel throttle body? Um, three thousand dollars. Because don't forget, Chris, these are drive by wire. So it's a pain in the ass. So you gotta get a drive-by wire pedal. Like you gotta pull the pedal out of this truck, mount it into the. So in, you can do double pumpers and everything. Yeah, just run a regular Holly four barrel. Really over target. Oh, nice first blood. Such a little motor. I see. This is gonna be. Well, this is coming with the motor, right? This is your oil cooler. Yeah, it's still attached right now. What we'll do is we'll cut those and we just pinch them. <clears throat> yes, dear? I was gonna say, I got a block for it, but. All right, guys. Back to some more time. There'll be a lot of time lapse in this video because this takes a long time to do. Everything's disconnected. Motor oh, mounts are out. Shit. Now, now we are uh, pulling the drive shaft. Yep, that's it. And the uh, cross member, and now she comes. Transmission's undone, transfer cases are undone, cross members undone, bolts are undone, everything's done. Oil cooler lines, we'll take care of them, bend them up. So do we want to clear some of this off? No, I don't think we have to go back that far. Oh, man. Probably a little bit. You're going to come out and go sideways, right? I don't know how you're doing this. Yeah, I think that's probably the plan, come out and go sideways. But even then... No, we don't want things to go sideways. No. <laughs> Get on it, see what we got. But just like the last video, guys, back to another time lapse. <laughs> Holy crap, guys, there it is. In its full glory. Motor, tranny, and transfer case. Holy crap. That is a heavy boy. It wasn't that bad. It took us two hours to pull the motor. Ready? I'm watching them. I'm watching them run right over them. It's fine. It's, fine. it's not my tools. <laughs> I'll give you 20 bucks, will you? Fine. Right? And just, you'll do it anyways?
Nice. All right, guys, we're going to end the video here. I mean, not much else to see. Thanks for watching. And remember, winners don't lift. Till next time.